what's up guys my boss here and today as you guys see we got ourselves the last of the player spotlights because it ends to pretty intense this week the player spotlight promo was only for the month of june so next week we're probably gonna get rookie premieres and to be honest with you guys i'm a little upset about it and this is the reason why because if we go to the new solos as you guys see we got more i thought that we were gonna get maybe a free player but no it's still 13 more solos you get 23,000 coins, complete them, get them all done. Just like the other two, you just got to play for the last one. It's a full three-minute quarter, or three-minute quarters, and that's it. That's all you get. You get no player at the end of it. Now, the reason why I thought that was because we're going to go back a little bit. If I can find it right now, because I have them all done. Where is it? There we go. For the positional heroes, at least at the end of this, as you guys see, you get a certain amount of solos. You complete it, you go all the way to the end, and what you would get is a collectible. At least with this, we were able to get three collectibles, put it into a set, and get a free positional hero. But, no. At least with this one, though, we could have got maybe a fantasy pack for it. But, no. Of course not. I mean, who cares? Madden 20 is a, literally a month away, which is incredible right now. We are so close to this game, and I can't wait to start pumping out uh, footage for you guys. So, right now... We're just going to go over the cards quick and let you guys get on with your Thursday. So right now we're going to go down to the player spotlights and go to anything that is new. So let's see. We're going to go to the 97s. If I saw who the last ones were for today, we got Jer uh, Jesse Bates. 97 overall free safety for the Bengals. 95 speed, play rec, and zone with 93 man. 84 hit power, 96 excel, and pursuit with 88 tackle. We're going to compare him right now to, honestly, I don't even have a free safety to compare him to, but honestly, a good card. Not bad for an all Bengals team if you guys want to rock that. And the other one, I seem to not be able to find him. I don't remember the, I got to look it up though. I got to see who the heck it is because I'm honestly drawing a blank on who the heck it is. So right now, we are going to go to the 98. Because let's see. Should be more of the expensive ones. Where are they at? Here we go. The first one is Amari Cooper. Now, one little debate I want you guys to have in the comments. Should he get paid like Antonio Brown and OBJ? Or should we wait till after this year and see how he plays? Let me know in the comments. Amari Cooper, 97 speed, 94 jumping, catching traffic, and short. With 93 catch, 96 spec catch, deep, and medium. We're going to pay him right now. We've had him before. His team of the week. And his card balled out for us. So right now we're going to compare him to everybody else. He would be a good number three, honestly, number two or number three in my system, pretty much. But honestly, if you guys are running Raiders teams or Cowboys teams, Amari Cooper's your man. Now let's see. For the other one, um, for the 98s, we're going to look at that in a minute. We have Sony Michelle, 99 overall rookie. He's got himself 96 speed, 98 excel, 99 agility and carrying with 72 catching. Uh, he's got 93 looseness, 97 trucking with 91 break tackle. We're going to compare him right now to Ricky Williams and Saquon Barkley. Card's really good, to be honest. We guys run all Patriots teams. That's what I would go with. Jesus, this kid will not stop inviting me. I told him I'll join in a minute, but whatever. Uh, if you guys want, though, he's actually live right now. The guy you just saw pop on my screen, my friend. I will leave a link to his Twitch in the description below. If you guys want to go check him out, maybe. We got Denzel Ward. We had his rookie premiere. He has 99 agility, press, speed, and excel with 98 jumping and man. 95 zone with 96 play rec. Comparing him right now to Rob Woodson, Jalen Ramsey. This card is pretty much Deion Sanders cloaked. Honestly, it's not even funny, except the, the coverages are a little bit lower than Deion. But other than that, that's this is the other card you want. The one I wish, he was at least an inch or two taller. And I think there's another Browns player that came out as well. Because if not, I do have it up right now from Twitter. So let's see. It's not 98, that was a 97. And no, he's not up there, but the other cards that came out was Brashad Perriman. He was the other uh, 97 overall that came out. I can't find him right now at this moment in the auction block. And if we go to the Bills, it is Marcel Darius. 
Those are the other two cards that came out today. And that's all the cards that came out today when it comes to the player spotlights. Now, for rookie premieres, let me know who do you guys think it's going to be. A lot of people are saying, for like, there's going to be 10 of them. So that was like a quarterback, running back, a wide receiver, tight end, an offensive lineman. Then you got, I believe, be a D end. Um, let me think. A D tackle, middle linebacker, corner, safety. That's how that's going to work. So let me guys know in the comments, who do you think is going to be? Who do you think it's going to be? Because I can only name a cover now at the top of my head. Like, say, for example, for the quarterback, I think it's going to be... Everyone says it's going to be Kyle Murray. I don't think so. The only reason why I don't think so is because he already got a 99. Plus, it's definitely going to make it easy to get him in the beginning of the year. I think it's going to be a guy maybe like Dwayne Haskins or Daniel Jones. I think it's going to be one of those two. Running back, it's going to be Josh Jacobs. That's what I questioned. Wide receiver, I believe it's going to be either Nikhil Henry, A.J. Brown, or Marquise Brown. One of those three. For a wild card, I'll throw in there uh, D.K. Metcalf. For the offensive line, really, I don't know. There's a lot of offensive line that came out of college from the draft uh, that just passed, so I'm not sure who that would be. For tight ends, I don't really know. I don't know. Wait, what am I saying? There's two that came out from Iowa. Duh. It's either going to be Noah Font. Or TJ Hawkinson, I'm going to think it's going to be Noah Font. That's why I think it's going to be. For defense, we go to the defensive line. For the defensive ends, D tackle is not going to be that hard. It's going to be Quinn Williams. DN, I believe it's going to be either Nick Bosa or Clinton Farrell. Um, For corner, I would say Greedy. But the only reason why I don't think is because... Normally, the rookie premieres that came out are all guys from the first round. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't think it's going to be him. I would definitely love for it to be Greedy Williams. He's got a ball in Cleveland right next to Denzel Ward. Watch. But if it's not going to be that, I'm going to go with um, that corner that the Giants drafted. I'm drawing a blank on his name. I think it's like something Baker. I forgot his first name. You guys can let me know on that. DeAndre Baker, I believe it is. Um, And at the safety spot... Uh, I'm not sure. I'll be very honest. I'm not sure. For, for the safety and linebackers, I'm not... Actually, what am I saying? Devin White. There we go. The man right here. Devin White will be the middle linebacker, or whatever the linebacker is going to be. But for the safeties, I honestly have no idea. For safeties and tight end and offensive line, I'm being honest, I have no idea who they would pick. So let me guys know who you guys think in the comments below. I hope you guys though did enjoy this video. If you guys did, please leave a like, subscribe if you are new, follow me on Twitter. My link will be in the description below. Hope you guys have a great day, and I'm out.